Hey guys, this is Professor LaRosso with LaRosso Private Training. This week we're going to talk about how to defend a very popular submission, but from standing. So in this video we're going to cover how to defend the standing guillotine defense. Now there's hundreds of escapes for this. I'm going to show you the one that I found the most effective and the one that like, a child could do, a kid could do, a grown man can do. You don't have to be, you know, a great fighter to do this technique. It's very simple. Um, very low effort, but the details are very important. So that's what I'm gonna teach you today. We're gonna go ahead and get into this. All right guys, so we're gonna talk about defending the standing guillotine. Um, so I get my head trapped. He's got an arm, he's got his grip, he's got a high elbow, okay? So there's plenty of ways to defend this. I'm gonna show uh, the one that I call the guillotine rollout defense, very simple. What I'm gonna do, similar to defending the double underhooks, is I need to create a little bit of distance. Now he's staying in tight, he's trying to choke. Okay, so I just need to push away a little bit. From this position, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna roll my chin down, yes, towards the choke, but watch. Once I pull my chin down, I'm gonna roll my head and my ear goes against his chest. Look at this position I have now. My head rolls right out. We'll do this side. So if he guillotines me, okay? It's choking, start choking me. So A, B, C, yeah, see that's a choke, right? So watch, you're gonna choke. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna roll right out, ready? Following out. Roll the head. Notice this elbow starts getting collapsed between my shoulder and my chest. Gripping, pulling my body to him, squeezing my knees. Let's do one more on this one. Pushing away. Look at this contact I have. The whole time my head is on him. And then I'm controlling right here. And that'll be able to set up our takedown. 